Every time I get a new package, I feel like it's Christmas. Okay, let's just get straight into this unboxing YouTube. So here's an overview of the box. And let's get to it. This is the pink iPhone 15 Plus with 512 gigabytes. For those of you who don't know, Apple did get rid of the plastic. So when you see these two green arrows are not tampered with, you are good to go. So... Now, for those of you who don't know, I did have the iPhone 13, and it was also pink, but this pink is different than that pink. I'll link the video up top so you can check out that video. But this pink is more of a, I feel like it's lighter in a way, and it's matte, which I'm not a big fan of, but it is what it is. The main reason why I got this phone, USB-C to USB-C cord. Thank you for the charger, Apple. And a sticker. And that's all that's in the box. That is pretty. Wow. It's very pretty. Let's set it up and then come back. Okay. So this is another overview of the phone. Okay. And I'm sorry guys if like I'm not really like that excited because I literally just had this color, but the only difference I feel like is that the back is matte, but my actual 13 was this color right here. And it was a beautiful color. In that video, I was very excited to have that phone. It's just that, like, Apple just, the recycling for me is just not it, you know. Um, but I do like the display. I noticed the difference in this, the display, and I will be doing a comparison between the 15 Plus and the 14 Plus because I'm currently... And getting rid of my boot 14 plus but this isn't about this this is about the 15 plus and the USB-C which I cannot wait so all of my devices could just have one charger which is going to be super convenient which is the main reason why I got this one to begin with 
and yeah like i just it's smoother you know when you buy something new from apple i will say like they make you feel like you have a new phone like you don't feel like oh you know it's just a regular phone like it's definitely new the island alone makes it feel new you know what i'm saying but i definitely am excited i but was confused on if i should get the iphone pro max because i really want this phone to last me for at least five years until it breaks so i wanted to get the best of the best of the best but apparently the iphone 15 pro max is having overheating issues which i want no parts of so i said okay plus it is and this pink was in back order so yeah Plus it is, and I had to wait for the plus, but it's okay, because I had a phone that was working perfectly fine, so I, it wasn't a big deal for me, but do be aware of the Pro Max having over, overheating issues, and do your research before you buy that phone, because that's what I did, so yeah, but at the same time, I feel like I bought the same phone in a way, but you know, we're here, and this is it. Let me know if you have any comments, concerns. Thank you for watching this video, guys. I appreciate you so, 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 so much. And yeah, comment below to let me know if you got any questions. And I'll see you guys in my next video. And once again, watch out for the comparison between the 14 plus and the 15 plus. Also the case, it's so pretty. Let's cheerio to another video.